YouTube. How the hell are you guys doing today? Hope you guys are enjoying the rest of your day, rest of your night, rest of your evening, depending on when you guys are watching this video. Hope you guys are enjoying everything today. Anyways, guys, uh, today's video is a little bit different. I know that I haven't been uploading from my last video that I uploaded on the channel here. Uh, just work has been really hectic, really busy and such. But um, nonetheless, guys, I uh, don't want to take up too much time on this real quick here. But um, what I did want to tell you guys is that I appreciate everything that you guys are doing for me so far. As far as uh, people coming in to the stream. Also for the clips that I've been uploading on YouTube. Stuff like that. So I just want to give my appreciation to you guys as always. I wouldn't be able to do most of this stuff if it wasn't for you guys. I got these questions um, on my stream, my, pa my previous streams. Uh, so these are questions from over time before uh, making this video and also questions off my Instagram. So just want to say thank you guys so much for everything that you guys do for me. And also I just want to appreciate each and every one of you. Um, the reason why I make this video is because I want people who are coming in onto my YouTube channel just randomly. to When they see this, uh, this video uploaded on my channel or when they see this video on my channel, they know who I am. They know what I'm about. They know what I like to do they get a more personal insight about me so it's not more of just solely gaming and just seeing me uh mess around with the boys or anything like that it's more of a hey this is who i am i want you to know that my streams my community is a safe place to come to if you're having a rough day that is pretty much the sole purpose of me doing this content creating streaming whatever the case may be this is the reason why i do this it is the reason why I wanted to pursue streaming and content creating. It's because I want to give you guys a safe place to come to whenever you're having a long day at work. If you were to lose a loved one, if you were to get into a car accident or if you any anything, really anything that you guys are going through, whether it's a rough thing, whether you guys just graduated from high school, just graduated from college, just had a kid, whatever the case may be. By the way, I want the kid to be named Tony or to in general, Tony. Tony is like a unisex name. T-O-N-Y, T-O-N-I. Whatever the case may be. If you're having a kid, name it Tony. Okay. Call it Tony. All right. Cool. Call it whatever you call it. The child or whatever you, you want to call it. But anyways, that is the reason why I am making this video. Even though it's a little overdue and past due, I should have made this video just from the very get-go. But like I said, guys, this is the reason why I make this, these videos, why I do what I do. So anyways, guys, hey, not to take up too much of your time, let's go ahead and get into these questions. If you guys are like this video or are liking the video so far and the content here on the channel, definitely leave a like down below. If you guys are new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. And also don't forget to check out all my social media links down in the description below. You guys will not regret it. Trust me, guys. On top of that, it's free. You don't even pay anything. So if it's free to sub, just make an account on YouTube or Google. Connect to your YouTube account or sign in with your, uh, with your Google account on YouTube. Come back to this video. Hit that subscribe button. Hit the like button. Let me know what you liked about the video. If you have any other questions, I'll be doing another Q&A um, in, in the future. Um, and also in one of the questions, I do cover my peripherals and um, pretty much a small bit of my setup. I am going to be making another video just dedicated to my setup itself. So yeah, guys, if you want to see that, definitely hit that like button down below. I want to go for 10 likes. I know that's not much. I want to go for 10 likes on this video. If you guys can hit 10 likes on this video, I will definitely do a whole setup video on the channel a whole setup video room tour whatever your case may be it'll be very bland on my walls as you can see here and by the way that's uh that right there this picture frame right here that's a baby me so if you want to see that picture in more detail in my next video my setup video definitely i want to see 10 likes on this video okay anyways guys hope you guys enjoy your rest of your day rest of your night rest of your evening rest of your week depending on when you're watching this video hope you guys have a good one Take it easy, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Love you guys. But, um, yeah, guys, so let's get into the first question. So I'm going to randomize all this here. So the first question I got is, um, do I have any pets? Um, yeah, I have three pets. I have three dogs uh, in particular. So I have Nala, Daisy, and um, Sport. So Nala and Daisy are a are poodle mixes. So one is a multi-poo, Maltese and poodle. And then also um, Shipu, which is Daisy. She is a Shih Tzu and poodle. So I have two of those, um, <clears throat> two of my dogs are poodle mixes, and then I have one that's an Eskijak, is what we were told that the breed was. Um, it's basically an American Eskimo and a Jack Russell Terrier. So <clears throat> I got him last year, so we've only had him for about a year or so. Um, he is currently two years old. He's going to be completing be uh, completing three in January, and um, yeah. So um, yeah, that, that goes for the pets. Anyways, moving on to the next question. 
What was your fr first game on PC played? What was your first game on PC played? Uh, so the first uh, game on my PC that I ever played, um, mind you, this PC I built. Uh, so the first PC game I ever played, like on a laptop, it was like a Dell Inspiron uh, laptop. So with that, I played co kind of a good majority of games on there. Um, one of them happened to be uh, Minecraft. Those that, that was one game that I played a lot growing up. Even when I was in high school, um, it was a game that I played a lot. In high school, um, I had two good friends of mine, uh, Steven and Tony, another Tony. Uh, I've probably only known two Tonys in my entire life. Um, but anyways, uh, all three of us, we would come over to my place and we would have our own server and we would just play Minecraft. We'd just screw around, mess around on there so it was it was pretty fun i mean we enjoyed our time there we we would do this pretty much like every other night or every other weekend so it was pretty cool so steven if you're watching this tony if you're watching this i remember you guys don't forget so next question um this is actually a um kind of a lengthy one uh as far as the answer for this one is uh, what equipment do you use for pc gaming so if we're talking peripherals i use a corsair um case k70 rgb uh keyboard so i use a k70 i think that's the the model of the keyboard it's a mechanical keyboard i think it has cherry switches in it um so i use that and my mouse is also a corsair mouse it is the corsair m65 pro rgb rgb pro um, it is a good mouse uh that's pretty much what i use as far as um gaming wise i do have a playstation 4 that i play on occasionally um using you know obviously my controllers and whatnot but uh my ps4 is a slim so yeah there's that so um to capture my games and, and uh record footage off my ps4 i use an elgato hd 60s so i'm gonna make another video also probably in the next coming month about my whole setup here um just so that you guys if you have any questions in the near future you guys can see what setup i have going on what i use uh, what my PC is made from or what it's built off of. Um, so yeah, I have a lot going on in my PC as far as component wise, but the main, main uh, components I have in here is a, uh, from a PC at least. Um, I'm running an Asus ROG Strix uh, 2070. It's not a super, it's a 2070 uh, NVIDIA G, uh, GeForce RTX 2070. Um, and I'm just right, running a Ryzen 5. That's pretty much what I'm running. A Ryzen 5 and a 2070 so the next question is when did you first start live streaming so when i started live streaming it was about a year ago uh give or say give or take um but i took it seriously when um back in february close to end of february uh streaming wasn't really that big of a thing for me like a year a year ago like or nine months ago um it wasn't that big of a deal for me but it started to you know grow up grow on me just because I know that there's this industry is such a huge industry to actually um, go ahead and, um, you know, for exposure, at least. So I know this industry has a lot of potential. That's why I'm putting a lot of work into it. That's why I have a lot of faith in it. So that's the reason why I started doing this. So I started streaming seriously back in February. So this is probably like eight, seven or eight months ago is when I started doing that. But um, yeah, I started taking it serious then. Um, but I have been streaming for about a little over a year now. So next question is, let's see. I'm going to randomize this because like I'm going down the line here. So let's see, let's see, let's see. Do you drink any supplements for gaming? So if we're talking about um, powdered energy, energy drinks, I do drink supplements for that. Um, for instance, here. This is... Um, one of my sponsors that I am sponsored by. By the way, guys, if you want to try some Rogue Energy here, here it is, right here, boom. I am sponsored by these guys here. They are a phenomenal company, an amazing company um, as far as flavors and such. I mean, I, I appreciate G Fuel by no means. I do appreciate them a lot. Just the fact that they have so many flavors and I'm too afraid to even order a tub from G Fuel that I might not like it. But that's just my personal uh, preference for me, at least. But for Rogue Energy, definitely, um, I do recommend these guys just because they do mix well in their shaker cups. 
and i wouldn't see why not because they're coming out with more flavors in the next coming months but i can't disclose any of that information anyways but yeah i guess if you want to try some definitely use code it's tony baloney for 10 percent off your uh next purchase and then yeah guys you could get you know 10 percent off a tub you can get 10 percent off a two-pack tub uh a tub and a shaker whatever the case may be 10 percent off your purchase and please 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 use that discount code if you guys want to save some money all right so next question is let's see who is your biggest esports influencer my favorite esports influencer would have to be um as like team wise would be chicago huntsman if it's an individual it would be nade shot and i know that's a little biased because you know nade shot scump formal all those guys crim six all those guys were um were part of optic and hex was was part of that too um but looking at nade shot and what he's accomplished compared to everyone else it's just a huge huge thing for me i look up to that i'm so, i'm like i i look i'm a, i look at him at like a role model so i mean it's just just seeing what he can accomplish i know i can push myself to do that so that's why i look at him as one of my um biggest esports influencers would be it would, would be uh nate shot have you ever participated in tournaments so i have um so when i was in about like seventh or eighth grade i took part in in a call of duty black ops tournament i forgot the name of it um i was part of a team called rebels it, it wasn't really like an esports team we just um pub stomped and we did search and destroy we did game battles stuff like that but um it was a team called the rebels we lost communication like after like after the summer so i couldn't really get in contact with them i wasn't on xbox 360 at that time i was in eighth grade mind you but um i'd play call of duty black ops or call of duty in general competitively so that's kind of what pushed me to play more games um and just the love of gaming just increased it just, it just grew more from there not increased it's the same shit but it grew more so that's what i've participated in when i was younger but as of up to date now i've participated in a couple apex tournaments uh, duos and trios i've com uh competed in uh warzone uh tournaments only one never gonna do it again because they don't know how to organize everything so but yeah so i've done warzone i've done apex um so i've participated in those tournaments as well I was trying to take part of the U.S. Army um, Search and Destroy tournament that they were hosting uh, a few, few weeks ago, if not a month ago, but we didn't have enough people to participate or compete in. All right, so moving on to the next question: What genre of movies do you like? So I have, I have a good. I don't. I'm not really that picky. I try to stem away from like horror films. What I mean by horror, I mean by like come out of nowhere and just like slit your throat very like gory like i try to stem away from those kind of the kind of movies especially the ones that are based on a true story you know what i mean but favorite kind of movies would be comedy movies um drama romance movies um they would be uh like um historic movies um documentaries stuff like that so that and um superhero movies so action movies and stuff and let's see have i traveled outside of the country and where so when i was a kid the only place i traveled out of the country was mexico and also belize so my parents are from central america my mom is honduran and my dad is from belize and when i was a kid i would say when i was like three maybe four years old i went over to belize i flew out there and then um also i flew out there when i was three or four i returned i went back few years later when i was around like seven or eight and then the last time i went was probably when i was like 10 or 11 maybe 12. what popular streamer would you wish to one day play with so one popular streamer i would wish to play with one day would be nate shot he's my role model so obviously i would say nate shot but anyone from the likes of marcel courage any of those guys honestly the big names in streaming those would be the guys i would want to play with the most but besides them I would like to play with like small like get a community of smaller streamers who are up and coming and just play with them you know what i mean so i just want to have that connection with them and then be able to play with them in the long run and actually build like a relationship with these guys so that's pretty much what i would say so what popular streamer would i wish to one day play with it would be nature for sure how do you handle criticism if you come across it honestly 
any kind of criticism that comes to me, whether that be positive or negative, um, it depends on how you take in that criticism also. Just keep that in mind. I just take it in and I learn from it. Even if it doesn't apply to me, I'll try to keep that criticism in mind just in case if something were, I, I were to do relates to it, then I can improve on it. But other than that, that's pretty much about it. So I just learn, I take it in, learn from it, think about it, make sure I got it down. And then I try to Im implement that into my work. If not, try to learn from it, like I said. Who is my favorite superhero? Spider-Man. What piece of advice would you give kids who are interested in joining the streaming industry? So to keep this answer to this, the answer to this question short, have fun with it. Just be yourself. Be yourself, have fun with it. And just try to engage as much as you can with your audience if you were to have one. Or if you have people watching you, try to engage with them. Ask them how their day is, you know. You talk to them like they were here with you in the room. Don't mind this mess, by the way. I know this is in the way. Just don't mind this. <laughs> this is just my laundry. I got to put it away. I know. I get it. I get it. I get it. I get it. Anyways, guys, that's going to be it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed everything so far today. Uh, this is a little insight for you guys to see who I am, what I like, what I like to do on my free time, stuff like that. So hope you guys enjoyed it. And yeah, guys, if you guys enjoyed everything today, definitely leave a like on the video. Uh, hit that subscribe button. And also don't forget to check out all my social media links down below. And yeah, guys, hope you guys enjoyed everything today. See you guys in the next one.